we were just about to leave. Hold on. On Probably cabin trip. Unplugged it when you pulled it. We're loaded up. Hold on. We're everything loaded up. And uh, Jeremy left his lights on for, I think it was like, what, like four minutes? And now oh, your battery's dead? Like an hour. Like it's hour. like these Ford pickup trucks, I tell you. It was an hour. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Doesn't... boost it. You got life. You got to get the boost on the thing, Aaron. Okay. Aaron, do your job. This is my job. It's too dark. You got a you got a hood light? Dude, I can't see anything. Where's the boost light? Why well, my other hand's full. Boost. Wow, start. Okay, I can turn this thing off. So Henry decided to get stuck on the way to yeah. the cabin. So here we are. Trying to get him out. Just give her. You know what? Your picture did not look like there was 18 inches of snow. So, what are we, kilometer from the thing still? Yeah, probably about a kilometer. Good start to the trip. We're gonna get get the truck out. We're gonna we're gonna try. I don't know if I can film and do this. Hey Jeremy, take the camera. Hit it. Yeah. All right, here we go. First attempt at pulling it out. We got winching going. We got Henry on the truck. Let's see what's a good angle here. We are going nowhere. Then apparently is using all the power he possibly can use. And his light bar turns off whenever he hits it. No. So uh -oh. that's unusual. Killed my quad. Now his quads just died. Oh, oh great. A shit show. Alright. To it. add a little more fun, Ben's quad died. We had to pull start it. Good thing that worked. Oh wait. Now the recoil is stuck out. So sound right. this is this oh, is just one slowly. thing after the other now, and it's snowing like absolute crazy, as you can see here. So yeah, we probably got about an inch of snow in the last oh, half an hour. You're good at that. Probably going to get snowed in tonight. So here we are. It's like one o'clock now. We found the path, but we, Henry or Jeremy stuck there, and the other one veered off the path and they're like way over there. Oh, well we should follow, we'll be able to follow that trail back easier now. Yeah. I just want to get there. This hey. is nuts. This snow is nuts. So Oh, 2.30 in the morning. Snack. We are at our favorite place. In the water. world. Amazing. We still have one stuck truck. Yeah, we, we abandoned the truck. And one truck that's about to get stuck. The Dodge is stuck. The Ford with the trailer is doing just fine. And we have one, and, and we have one invalid. On one by yeah. two. And <laughs> Jeremy is injured. He's been, he's been sitting here all Jeremy's night. Jeremy's a one by two. I'm a one by two. It's okay. Well, anyway, things are looking up. We're pulling, yeah, we're pulling an all-nighter all tonight. This trip is, uh, everything is turned around for the best. And then by all-nighter, we mean I'm going to go to bed in like 20 minutes. That's me too. As soon as my food's cooked. Breakfast time. We got some egg and hash brown mush. Pretty good though. Jeremy is uh, recuperating nicely. Look at the Yep. Still attached. We haven't had to amputate yet. We thought it was going to be black this morning. Yeah, it doesn't look too bad. Oh, very good. Good breakfast. Ben's cooking some sausages, and then we are going to go and get the truck unstuck. Should be interesting. And the temperature has just dropped 10 degrees. Did it? Well, oh, 20. yeah, it's cold. Breakfast number three. <laughs> yeah. We had sausages, eggs and hash brown, mush, and now Ben's just cooking up some of the hash browns. We got nothing better to do. No, it's not like we have stuck truck or anything. I'm gonna get out later. We got one so far. I'm not convinced you're gonna be able to get out that easily. Probably not. Anyway, it's still snowing out here.
but it is beautiful. Doesn't want to go. Did you trade it? Did you trade this thing in for a Yamaha? He just got the engine swapped. Oh yeah, that's yeah. what happens when you run Polaris. Yeah. Just don't say anything bad about Can Ams. You get hate. Yeah. Okay. We gotta dig more. So we've gone under the truck. As you can see, as you can see, it's uh, fairly sunken in here. And uh, we're trying to jack it up so we can throw a quad ramp underneath this tire. And then we are going to, if that doesn't work, we're gonna have to get Jeremy's truck, which is way down there, and try to jerk it out, make a path. We got lots of options yet. Not even worried in the least. Right, Henry? She's free. She's yeah. May the force be with you. What are you doing? Shit! Why did you do that? I... You're, you're neutral. It slipped into neutral. You did that? It slipped into neutral. That sucks. Should have bought a fork. Make sure that one around you pop up. You're good. Yeah. You're good. You're good. Well, so far, we've made it one truck length. <laughs> we're doing good. Yeah. We are in motion. We're doing one half. We're doing like three inches at a time. We got one ramp for traction. We're just trying to make a little run here. This stuff is like sugar. Like it doesn't pack, so you can't even make a trail really. Ramps, we need ramps again. Oh. Now he's off path. Need ramps? Okay, hold on. Gotta just work a path in. And we were gonna try to drive them all the way down there. Oh yeah. <laughs> Freedom! Almost. Hopefully this one's not stuck. Ah. Uh. Yeah, I don't know. Who knows? Who cares? We got all day? Yeah. You got something better to do? No. <laughs> not at all. This is great. <laughs> Minus 22. It doesn't feel cold at all. No, it's just well, because we're working our... I know. That's true. Not a single part of me is cold. <sighs> well, Jeremy's almost out, so that's good. Oh, she broke. The strap broke. <laughs> so we're 75% the way there. And now we just got to pull this trailer. We're going to pull it with uh, first the TRX 3, uh, 350. And then Aaron's going to be the, uh, the workhorse on this one. Making progress. Yeah, 
Yeah. Look at that even flame. <laughs> so we made it out of the. Uh, this is what you want. We made it out of the snow. Now we're all feeling very relieved. Jeremy's feeling better. Just changed his underwear. <laughs> and uh, Ben's it's, cooking. Uh, what is that? Some Yule Deer tenderloin. tenderloin yeah. This is uh, heart. It's no, it's tenderloin. tenderloin. Yeah, it is. It's really <laughs> smoking here. I think my lens is. That oil I put in there. My rosemary olive oil. Anyway, now we can relax. It's rum and coke time. Yes. And lunch. We, we got the uh, pizza flops going over here. We can officially go home at any time. Yep. We've got the Marlin. Uh, what is this thing? It is a... Government. Government. But there's a model number on here. It is a... It is a... Oh! Here it is. 1985 GS 4570 Government. And uh, it's pretty sweet. It's a little guide gun. I bought it because it fits nice. Lever action. I'm gonna see it. She's ready to go. Let's we'll see what it does to this plate, this metal plate. It knocked it over. And it's. It used to be resting out against that tree. <laughs> Take a look at this muzzle. This is ridiculous. It's a pretty big bullet. This has like, the this equivalent. This is my finger. This is my finger here. Apparently this has the equivalent like muzzle energy as like a 375 H&H &H Magnum. It's ridiculous. It's a good dub. Put her down. Grizzly gun. But it drops like 10 inches at 20, 200 yards. I'll shoot it between your legs. No. Okay. <laughs> All right. Okay. Here. Ready, Aaron? What? <laughs> One, two, three, jump. <laughs> <laughs> Too cold out here. I got my, uh, freezing. Very cold. I'm shaking. It's a whole lot of grain right there. It's so blurry. First, <laughs> say 17 WSM. Well, I want to focus. Anyway, what color is the tip on there? You got black tips. Oh, they're not. They're not A Max. They're not uh, B Maxes. Then. Not B Maxes. They're cheap grade. Cheap grade because I got them for charging cheap. We're shooting this target. Out of ammunition. Is that five? I don't know. Not five. You brought your HMR too? <laughs> oh. Wow, look at that group, stacking them. Stacking. All right, getting ready for something to go down. It's uh, Aaron doing a little uh, firewood patrol, taking out some deadfall. And uh, Ben and Henry will be going out to the local cut lock, just uh, a little ways away here and see if they can call on a couple of coyotes or something. So stay tuned, let's see what happens. We just heard the boys come back from wolf hunting, so we're about to show you guys what a great Alberta wolf looks like. And here so it is. here we go, Alberta wolf! Where's your wolf? Where's the wolf? The wolf froze to death. It's too cold. Oh, it's too cold. Oh, Hen Henry, does he? Have, he maybe he has the wolf. There's mm. bloody cold on the floor. No. Henry, Henry's just gonna get himself stuck. Oh, this is epic. So no coyotes this up. place has no life, no life at all. We did oh. see some moose tracks though. Well, oh, other than that one moose, there's nothing here. That's end of day this, one. So I have this tote here. Yeah. Not exactly tote up here. <laughs> Good night, all. Good night. Nighty night. We will stook this fire. Is this your your? Oh, this is mine. Just wondering where your camera was. It's in my head. Okay. Thanks. <laughs> Morning. Look at Jeremy's fancy vest. Explain to us how it's, it works. It's mood sensitive, as Henry explained a little bit earlier. Yeah, it's cold. So this is uh, this is cold, or the generator is turning on gas. <laughs> so I'm sad, or I'm angry, or just mellow. Well, the, so, the, the generator just ran out of gas. How do you feel? I, 
And depending on his mood, the jacket heats him up appropriately. Like when you're angry, It'll it get gets him more. hot, turns his face all red. How are you feeling, Ben? Not very good. I had a really bad sleep, but that's over now. We have another day ahead of us. I made a really good trade with Aaron. He went uh, from the top to the bottom. I went from the bottom to the top. And my sleeping bag supposed to better. supposed to function in minus forty. I'm naturally cold by nature. <laughs> and um, did the generator die or what? And I was this warm up there. Dibs out filling the generator. Dibs out. I'll do it. <laughs> <laughs> So, temperature this morning. Oh, we got more snow last night. It is a balmy minus 25, 24 degrees. Yeah, it's what, four inches? Three and a half? Three and a half inches of snow. And that was from like last night. Oh boy. Oh boy. Find the quads first. <laughs> this poor thing. We have ignition. Ooh, ooh. My battery is too cold. So our batteries are so dead because it's so cold. Oh. <laughs> Great. Okay. <laughs> ben, pull hard. It's yeah, it will go in. You can pull hard. It's right there, eh? It won't go there. I want to see if my quad, the oldest one, piece of junk. Probably. This is going to be good. I'm sweating. All these new fancy quads. And all you need is a an old pull cord, pull choke. <laughs> Gotta give it a little throttle here. No, what you need is good battery. Isn't it fire? Oh, Ben's got something. Oh, is Aaron? Well, we're almost. Yeah, we're one for four. So close! That doesn't work. I don't know about that method. Now we'll go because there's some gas in there. Oh, so close. Close. Oh yeah. Don't touch it. Let it let it idle. Let's get to work on this thing now. Okay, disaster 572. Can't get this in. <laughs> nice. This is gonna be very interesting.
disaster number 932. Unusual disaster. <laughs> Surprising. We lost the recoil starter for Jeremy's quad. And of course, the electric starter, the battery is dead. So my quad's now dead. Luckily, it thing, died. We oh, parked literally died right, right by the truck. Yes. That's so, uh, guess you'll be doubling for the rest of the day. Yeah. But at least the pushback to the truck is short. <laughs> That's true. We gotta, we gotta take some benefits out of this. Yeah. Oh, this is awesome though. Oh, this powder is Shred great. That pow. <laughs> My quad had a bit of a hiccup. It just all of a sudden died. Well, it died, but it didn't have any power. Now, and then running it for a little bit, it fixed itself. The Hondas do that. They're self-regenerating. <laughs> yeah. You should just throw that thing back at the quad. Yeah. It will, it will fix itself. It will reattach itself. It's just a scab right now. It will heal. Exactly. Heal right over. <laughs> exactly. Uh, well, we got everything packed up. The sun is on its way down. What a great weekend. Just love this place. And uh, it's time to head for home. <laughs> We're shredding the mud powder. Henry's blazing the trail. Too bad this thing's all fogged up. This pillar's chuck is chucked in the top of the house. Wildlife of the whole trip, it's when we're coming home. <laughs> <laughs> 